Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. Today I want to share with you this so easy but beautiful headband. Now we're living in fall and uh, weather is getting cold. That's the so important pieces for us. Uh, if you don't want to uh, take your bennies, you can take your headbands and uh, not so cold to your ears. Uh, I like it very much. It's so easy and fast crocheting. You can use that stitch in every project. I tell every detail in the video. Uh, you can make only one ball, three or four. Uh, if you make it for a child, you can make four or five headbands, one ball. If you make it for an adult, you can make three, uh, nearly uh, four. Uh, it's about your yarn's uh, thickness. Okay. Uh, so easy, hope you like it and uh, hope you will try and share with me. Thanks for your watching from now and thanks for your support. Uh, you can reach me on Instagram, on Facebook and on Pinterest as the same name crochet with Gigi. If you're ready, we can start to crochet our headband. I will use in my hairband um, Rambayan, Madame Tricot Paris. Favori. Uh, it's a hundred percent of acrylic and one ball is a hundred grams 3.5 oz and 330 yards 210 meters and they recommend us using four or five millimeter hook but I want to use a six millimeter hook okay and you can um, wash it in 30 degrees uh, not put in the dry machine and you can ironing this yarn I want to give you the color number color is one we will start our hairband with chains first of all make a slip knot then making chains not so tight or not so loosey. Okay, be ca careful that. I will make mines after I will tell you how much centimeter and how many chains I did. Okay, I make mine and turn to you. I made 65 chains uh, with my yarn and uh, 6 millimeter hook and it's come to the 50 centimeter after we put the stages it gets more wider okay don't forget that uh, if you uh, this size for the adults but if you want to make it uh, for child you will uh, measure the turn all around the head uh, approximately 40 45 46 centimeter is enough for the child's okay for babies 40 42 centimeters you can uh, measure your which you uh, who you want to make this band you can make your chains uh, in this centimeters after that yarn over and skip that first stitch insert into the next Grab the yarn and make a slip stitch. Only we make this stitch in this band. Yarn over, insert into the next one, grab the yarn and make a slip stitch. Yarn over, insert into the next one, grab the yarn and make a slip stitch it's a little hard for the first row like that yarn over insert into the next one grab the yarn and make a slip stitch do the all the stitch that uh, half slip stitch I don't know its name because not making directly slip stitch we uh, first of all yarn over then insert into the stitch grab the yarn and make a slip stitch 
yarn over, insert into the next one, grab the yarn and make a slip stitch. I will make all the stitch that after turn to you. I make all the stitch that uh, yarn over and slip stitch. Chain one and turn my work. Now yarn over again. This is our first stitch and uh, not count that chain one. It's turning. Here you can see the front and the back loop. I insert into the only back loop, grab the yarn and again make a slip stitch. Yarn over, insert into the back loop, grab the yarn, make a slip stitch. Not insert here, look at here, uh, seems to be loops, but our loops is on the top. Okay. Yarn over, insert into the back loop, grab the yarn and make a slip stitch. Yarn over, insert into the next back loop, grab the yarn, make a slip stitch. Do the same thing all of the row. I finish that row and turn to you. I finish the second row and we repeat all the same all of the rows. Now chain one and turn and not count that chain. Yarn over, insert into the first stitch back loop. I insert my hook, grab the yarn and make a slip stitch. Yarn over, insert into the next and make a slip stitch. Make a slip stitch. We work on the back loops, yarn over and make a slip stitch. That's it only. I will keep repeating. I think a minimum six or eight rows I will repeat that. After turn to you and I will say how many rows, how much centimeter I crocheted. I will tell you. I finish that and turn to you. I finish my rows. Uh, I crocheted eight rows totally and chain one and cut my yarn with long tail. I want to give you my bit is seven centimeter, nearly three inches. So you can make it more wider or more little. Okay, it's your choice. It's reversible, so it's not important how do you fold. You will take two sides and make them double folded like that. Then insert them like that together. Take your needle and start to sew all the sides together. It's so easy. Take all the sides, okay. I want to make one more time. You can make this handband uh, with one ball yarn 
nearly three or four headbands you can make it only one ball then turn it to the front side and here our headband is ready hope you like it it's so easy you can uh, make in one day two or three uh, you can make it in every size for a child for an adult it's not important because uh, only uh, only one point you have to be careful uh, turn all around your head it's enough you can use that stitch all your projects i like it very much if you have any questions please leave me comments and don't forget subscribe to my channel you can reach me on instagram on facebook and on pinterest as the same name crochet with Gigi. hope to see you in new videos have a nice day bye bye